thank you for being here. I know you don't have to, but it means it means a lot. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm a monster. I'm gonna get you. Literally, all I want to do is fucking sleep. The, the, the sun's always already rising. So, another. Oh, I'm so tired. Oh, fuck. Uh, mm. Hello, it is 5.40 in the morning, and I've been up for about 80 hours, and I am taking about a 3.5 mile walk to the gas station to get some pleasant drinks of soda deliciousness for my exhausted, manic, bearded, filthy face. And my neighbor is apparently having a bonfire at 5.40 in the morning. You are the scouty snout, silent and sure, keeping watch in the night, keeping watch in the night. Sir, that is not your gnome. That is not your gnome, sir. Sir. Leave the gnome alone, you son of a bitch. Hey, Scout. Thank you for being so amazing. Thank you for being so sweet. You fucking hear it, don't you? Yeah, I fucking hear it. Oh, no. oh, fuck you. Like, fuck you. Who's making the sound? <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna kill you. Whoever you are, you're dead. Okay. Yeah, you trying to, now you're trying to calm me down? Scout. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. You didn't do anything wrong, I promise. Hey there, Mr. Raccoon. You enjoying that cat food, buddy? He's got some tasty cat food. On, baby when the moon smiles down on me bathe me in its light uh oh I fell asleep beneath you <clears throat> well, it's been a while since I slept but you can't see them but I got two new baby doves hiding underneath mom right there so that's cool. Fuck. Um, excuse my language. <laughs> hmm. I don't even know what I've. She knows. It's a good
good girl. You scared him off, baby girl. You scared him off. Mr. Bandit says, I just want some love, but who's jealous? Who's a jealous girl? Scout. There is the International Space Station. Moving like the wind. Even with the clouds, it's still pretty bright. Hey, hello and hi. Um, for those of you who have made it this far into the video thank you so much that video was kind of like a fever dream it, the last almost three months were bad i actually didn't take a shower for two months because the depression from some pretty intense episodes of hallucinations it it was bad but thank you so much for sticking around to watch the whole thing um next is just a reading of a new poem i wrote it's very short but it's my attempt to describe what it's like to grieve a past life who you once were the how those comparisons to your current self stick with you like a venom that's been injected into your veins that never quite leaves you and how hopeless that can feel to think you'll never measure up to who you once were i hope you enjoy it's called they take you in moments In the stillness of the empty, a lone candle blinks out. They took you from me in pieces without a single gutted shout. The slow chop of your memory till the nothingness of eternity, stilling you in moments to my agony, a dark Shakespearean tragedy. In the turbulence of the void, that waxed wick mournfully sings, a chorus of loss overjoyed with the painted pain that it brings.